And welcome back guys. So I'm going to be doing my review regarding Dead Island 2 here. And my review of Dead Island 2 would be... It's an alright game. When we look at it. Of course all the busy traffic decides to come by now. My review of Dead Island 2. I wish the storyline was longer. <laughs> it felt kind of short to me. And the time frame that I was able to play the game. It seemed kind of short. I also think that there should be less, like, waves of enemies coming out at you. What are they doing? Copying Gears of War 3? That's what I felt like. Some some of these, like, uh, waves where you clear all those zombies felt like Gears of War 3 gameplay where you're sitting there, you gotta survive three waves of this crap. Like, it's already been played before. Why are we doing it again? <laughs> Uh, but other than that, I, I enjoyed the gameplay regarding Dead Island 2. Uh, I look forward to seeing a DLC or something like that. I also wish that their storyline from the first game carried over to the Dead Island 2, where it actually made some kind of sense of why it started. Uh, you know giving hints in the beginning of how the disaster in Dead Island 2 happened. This way, it actually seems like Dead Island. <laughs> I'm guessing it was a new studio that took over playing or creating Dead Island 2, I'm guessing. Uh, anyways, so where do we go from here from playing games? That's a real question. It's gonna go over here away from all the NPCs. So it's quiet. So where do we go from here? Well... Then the simple answer, I either go back to my Fallout 4 series and get that finally done. Or I go back to the the 4 series. I've decided not to do the side quest. Uh, it seems like after you get one side quest done, it just pops up with another one, another one, another one. And they're not really that interesting, from what I can tell. They're actually kind of boring in my point of view. Uh, for instance, the Amanda quest over on the pier, it's literally just fighting waves of zombies. And it's just gets very boring over a certain period of time. It's fun for the first maybe five to ten minutes, but after that, you know, you just constantly fighting the same shit over and over again with waves. It gets very boring very, very quickly. Uh, so, that's the news regarding Deadline 2. Regarding me, uh, I know I said in the last video when I beat the game that I was considering doing side quests. I retract that original thing that I said, and we are not doing more side quests regarding Deadline 2 unless there's a DLC that comes out for it. Um, so what I'm probably going to do is I'll probably go do gameplay of like Fallout 4 for a little while. I know that's an old game. It's not on the channel yet of me playing it. Like There's bits and pieces of it. it. And then I think... After that, I'll, go, I'll mix it between Sons of the Forest gameplay. Uh, I know Diablo is coming out. I've decided that I'm going to play Diablo. Oh boy, here we go again. And yeah, this upcoming week, the group that I play with on Rust is not going to be on Rust, except for one other person. So I might be on. I'm also going on vacation in June, so. We'll have to see what happens. <laughs> Anyways, I wanted to give you an update regarding Dale and 2, my review. Uh, where are we going from here? We're probably going to Fallout 4. We're probably going to Sons of the Forest. We're probably going to... Oh, goodness gracious, let me look at my list of series we're working on here. Uh, so, yeah. Fallout 4 would be the next one we work on. And then Sons of the Forest, mixture of Sons of the Forest or Terraformers. Yep, pretty much. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for supporting the channel. 
Also, another thing that's on the list to go and play is Anno 1800 is also something I'm working on, um, possibly putting as a series on this channel. I tried doing the other series, uh, the other Anno, I think it's 2077. But it, the game launcher's messed up on it, so <laughs> that's why we're not playing that yet until I figure out a way around that. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. Make sure you like button, make sure you subscribe button. I wanted to give you guys a review regarding Dead Island 2, what I thought about it, where we're going from here. And I'll see you guys next video. Thank you for supporting the channel.